hi friends, this video is going to be very different, but also very necessary because today is National Suicide Prevention Day. And as someone who has been a steward of mental health awareness for, for my industry, for my friends, for myself, and as someone who has lost people to suicide, it was on my heart to send this message out to provide a couple of resources in case you're struggling. Because what I will say is that the people that I have lost never saw it coming. Absolutely never saw it coming. And so I don't want anybody to suffer in silence. So number one, if you are out there and you are struggling, you're needed and you're important and you are loved and we need you here. Number two, as someone who has managed my own anxiety over the years, there are different things that I've done that I want to share to help those that are struggling or let anxiety get the best of them. One is the, the rule of threes and understanding that there are different things that you can do to distract yourself from your anxiety or from any kind of a negative spin. So number one, find three things that you can see. Identify those. Focus on those three things. Identify three things you can hear and move your body in three different ways. That helps trick our minds into not focusing on the anxiety and not focusing on the negative and helps put us in a different mindset. Also, breathing is a, is a critical piece of this. As someone, when I, when I feel stress or anxiety coming on, I, I tend to take very deep, intentional breaths. You know, there are many schools of thoughts around box breathing and deep breathing. But if I'm breathing in and breathing out longer, I'm pushing the negativity out of my body. So try taking a big, deep breath for four seconds, holding it, and then blowing it out for six. Whatever feels right to you. But just take time to slow down. Take time to pay attention to what you need and take time to focus on your energy. Um, as I always talk about, music is a big thing too. There are songs galore that help me get through tough times, help me get through times where I don't feel as confident or feel stressed out. And so I want to share, you know, if you go to my Spotify through my website, <clears throat> I've got playlists galore for different moods, different genres, but different ways to manage anxiety and manage stress. But figure out what is right for you. Go build a playlist today of songs that you know will bring you into a good mood, bring you more confidence, slow down your anxiety. Um, but what I also want to do is, is provide a safe space. And so I'm going to share a QR code that is anonymous. And it is, you know, whatever you submit is anonymous. I don't know who submits what. But I want to provide this, this safe haven for, for you to share something that's on your mind. Because... As we all know, all of us are carrying around something that nobody else knows about and something that is weighing on us. So by going to this QR code, you can get that off your chest. To me, anonymously, I'm not going to know who says what. But I want you to have the ability to put it out somewhere besides your heart and your mind. So please go to this QR code as you feel comfortable and share something that you're carrying around right now that you wish people knew about and maybe you're not comfortable talking about it. But please take advantage of this because it will help you get that stress and that, that hurt off your mind. And at least it'll relieve some of the pressure that you may be feeling like is suffocating you or pressing you down. And finally, as I was in North Dakota last week, I was driving along a highway in literally the middle of nowhere. And on the side of the road, there was a sign that said, and in the event of a crisis or suicidal thoughts, dial 988. So if that is something that if you've gotten to that point where you're just struggling, you don't feel like there's a way out, dial 988 and talk to somebody. That's what they're there for. I wish that sign wasn't just in the middle of nowhere. I wish it was in every suburb. I wish it was on every highway. I wish it was everywhere. And so if I can share that information, I want to do so. So here we are. But just know that you are important, that you are needed that we need you here. And I know what you're probably going through. It's painful. It's a struggle. But it's going to be okay. And so please know that you are cared for and that you are loved, if anybody, by me. And I just need you to know that. So please take advantage of these resources. Take advantage. Send me, send me the thing that's on your mind. Call 988 and talk to somebody Use these breathing resources and music and, and whatever it need, whatever you need. Take time for yourself. Slow down and take time for yourself. It has never been more important than it is today, especially. But moving forward, everything will be okay.